so today we are creating pong game so this is the game which we are creating today this is a simple pong game game but in the upcoming videos of game lab series we are going to build a pong game which will have which will just just which will like play against a computer like here is a single player game but in the upcoming videos we are going to build a type of pong game that will actually play with the computer and that will actually compete with the computer yes it will compete with the computer so this is actually single player game which will play with us only this is just a simple pong game so that you understand game lab much better that is why here i am bringing such such videos to you all but as soon as you are just perfect in game lab i shall be posting the video of pong game that will actually play against the computer there would be two rounds like one would be computer and one would be the player and that would be a awesome game so but today let's just focus on this pong game and i am happy which we have built our own pong game pretty simple but it's fine so as soon as it touches this as soon as it touches this paddle then what happens it will just score a putt so let's start making go to code the towachi Then create a new game lab project. Next, adding sprites. Variable ball. Variable paddle. So we are going to draw our own paddle rectangle tool. Like this, and just fill the color with white. That's fine. Here, just name it as paddle. Now, ball. Draw your own. So, just I will delete this. I will just upload the file. Upload that image. So don't worry, you can also get this image. I will just provide you this image just in the description. I will. You can also ask me. So wait, it's not coming. So I have one option. So upload the image. So what next we can do is I will just open my image with Snip Snatch and I am just going to copy this image. Wait, my laptop is just hanging. It's copied. Now I will add a new draw your own. And I'm going to paste it now. It's not copying. And now I'll paste. Now yes, import. And this link will be available to you. Don't worry. Just your work is ask me the image link and you will be getting it. 
but I'm a little doubtful because let's just see if the ball is working fine. I will just draw this price. What if I give the background as, as black? Reset run. See. The cost of problem. So no worries. We are going to just do ball pong game. So you can search for pong game ball vector. Then you can search for an image. Now you can just scroll down to get more appropriate images. So now just copy this image, go to remove.bg, paste the image, send me plus B. Now copy this image, go back to your form game, delete this, add a new animation, draw your own, send me plus B. Again copy, go here, center plus V, I don't know if there is an issue here or what problem, you know we have to just get this. I will try again. Now it's coming. Import. Now it's fine. Here, just my name as ball. Now go to code. Now if it's coming, yes everything is coming. Now you have to scale the ball. Most ball you can do 0 0.05. So now the paddle gave it somewhere here. 200, 350 you can give 400 now it's fine all things will be 70 Find a ball, you can just increase the size of the ball a bit 0 0.1. No, 0 0.07. Now, fine. Now, you can add a score text. So, slide score. Just make it two 
20 then fill by then the size we set one you can increase the size to 25 fine 22 Fine, now we will add one more variable score. So fine, now we want that this should move. Saddle, so we will add if key down is equal to left then what's going to happen then the sprite dot x that is paddle dot x is equal to paddle dot x minus phi and if key down is equal to right then pride dot x paddle dot x is equal to paddle dot x plus phi now run so yes it's moving now we want to make that now we are making that ball dot velocity y ball dot velocity y is equal to 6 and ball dot velocity x is also equal to 6 is equal to 6 then suppose then when we run see is doing next what we are doing is we are next creating edge sprites we are creating edge sprites then we are doing that ball dot bounce off that the ball is going to bounce up from the edges plus you see when we run ball, ball is actually bouncing off with the edges now let's do that it also bounces with the rectangle so that we are doing it if suppose the ball bounces with the paddle if suppose the ball bounces with the paddle then the score is going to increase score is equal to increase to score plus one now let's run sorry the spelling is wrong paddle is paddle reset and run see now we can see it doing but it's doing it so far away so we'll go here go to paddle and just do crop the sprite now go to code and let's run So we can change the exposition of ball 
टू टू एटी एंड वन and with this we have created our pound loop we can do some changes here we can do 150 and 100 and then we can do 100 ball dot Set collider. You can do ball dot set collider with circle. Also, we can do that ball dot x is equal to actually no need of this. And there yeah, the problem is coming because we have done two times we have not done ball or velocity x. Now run. See now it's coming good. Only it was like just sleeping it was. It was just moving like that. Now it's moving from x also and y also. See now it's our pawn game is ready. So name it as simple pawn game. Okay. 